completed in 2013 with Executive Director Shu Martin and Programs Coordinator Valentine Fru, Green Partners Association is a non-governmental organization with a vision of sustainability and equality for all. They are engaged in improving livelihood, elevating involuntary social exclusion, and enhancing productive capacity of people and the natural environment through the human rights-based approach to sustainable development. The organization has a motto, engaging, empowering, and equipping partners for a resilient people, resilient planet, and resilient profit. With so many non-governmental organizations existing, what makes Green Partners Association different? Green Partners has four main objectives, which are based on our field of expertise. The first one is to promote corporate social responsibility and environmental social governance in Cameroon. And the second one is human rights. We are human rights defenders and uh, our particular attention is on the rights of the child, especially to education, the rights of women and uh, gender equality, indigenous and minority rights, and land and resource rights. And the third is career coaching and mentoring with particular attention to youth. And the fourth is research and development with particular attention to action-oriented research. With the unprecedented crisis that has plagued the Northwest and the Southwest regions of Cameroon, precisely the two Anglophone regions, our peculiar attention has been focused for the past four years on the rights of the child to education, nutrition, water, sanitation and hygiene, and all other protection needs. After the closure of schools, Green Partners Association took it as their responsibility to promote and protect children's rights to education, children's rights to protection, and children's rights to wash. It's worth noting that after the closure of schools, over 800,000 children were deprived of their rights to education. Green Partners Association launched a campaign for non-formal education and equally created learning spaces in churches. With co-funding from UNICEF in 2020, Green Partners Association was able to reach at least 50,000 beneficiaries each year, including children, teachers, and parents with the following services. Disinfection and sensitization against COVID-19 in formal and non-formal learning environments, markets, and public offices. Distribution of learning materials, ECD kits, dignity kits, wash kits, pre educational kids to conflict affected children. They equally provided non-formal learning programs. They were equally able to train teachers on psychosocial support and conflict disaster, risk reduction in Douala, Boya and Bomenda. They were equally able to provide radio education programs to out of school children in conflict affected areas with great attention paid on indigenous borough children, which some parents now attest on how much their children benefited from these radio programs. And as part of our food, I want to thank you so much for the realizations you have done in the Bafu Fundum in the area of education. You have provided quite much. And I want to strongly recommend that you consider various areas hit by the war, uh, such as uh, our water system all destroyed, various schools uh, destroyed, health centers, and uh, we need a lot in terms to support the youth. This is Chair Mary Gogomo, the principal of Fulgos High School, Bamenda. Carry our message to the green partners that we are very, very grateful. They are always thinking about us. We are grateful with the gifts and even to UNICEF, our donor, that we are grateful. We would have loved even the boys, the student boys, to have the touches too, because it will help them in reading. Even some teachers were also asking if they could be given because they are also going through the crisis. And we are saying that this is our big hall. We know benches, we know desks. 
if the green partners or even the UNICEF through the green partners could also help us to give us benches, to give us decks and even more, we will be very grateful. My name is Kokolo I want to thank these people, the green partners with the books and the pen that they give me to learn how to write and to read. Thank you for the radio. He also helped us to read and write. Also we touch to use like touch when the light goes on. We want to thank you people so much for the help that you people have got for us. And let God increase what you people are sending for us. Let God also give you people strength to continue doing it for us, to help us. Thank you. While respecting the core principles of neutrality, impartiality, humanity, independence and do no harm, Green Partners Association has very promising future plans. Concerning our future plans, we believe that this population in need that is ever increasing, we desire to meet their needs, especially the children, out of school children, that because of this crisis, they are no longer going to school. We desire that in the nearest future, every child has a right to education. And that is what is giving us the desire to go ahead with this work. Um, we also, in order to meet the needs of these children, we need other additional funding bodies because at, at the moment we have uh, UNICEF, which uh, is helping us to meet the needs of over uh, 50 something thousand children. But the children in need in this crisis hit region is far and above 200,000. So uh, we will need the assistance of other uh, funding bodies to be able to help us in this light. Uh, it, it, we, we desire in the nearest future, in the long term, to be a sustainable organization in order to be self-sustaining. So we are not looking down on the support from funding bodies, but we desire also to meet the needs of a wider population. Uh, in the recent past, our uh, service van too was vandalized because of this crisis and in the nearest future, we hope to replace that van in order to get to the hard to reach areas so that these children can be satisfied with our services.